Hi Church Mice friends, it's Adamo here. I hope you're having a really, really good start to the week. Uh, just wanted to share with you a really cool story. This is Noah's Car Park Ark. But before we look at some amazing animals in here, I just wanted to show you a new addition to our family. So just the other Wednesday, so seven days ago, we heard a noise in our porch coming from an egg that we had in an incubator. And then little baby Florence popped out. And this is Florence. And she's a new part of our family. Don't you think she's totally lovely? Oh, oh, Reuben thinks she's totally lovely. And I think she would love a little ride in Noah's car park arc. So why don't we have a look at that book together now? Okay, I'm gonna put Florence back down here where she's comfortable. There we go. Noah's car park arc. A long time ago in a far off land, there was just dry sand and no rain planned. But a man called Noah, such a wise old fella, heard God say, go buy an umbrella. I'm sending some rain. I think it's for the best. And I've sent every animal your home address. No need to panic. It's just two of each. And you'll float in a boat till you reach land on a beach. So Noah replied, I build what an ark, a zoo boat, a petting ship, a sea ferry park. Exactly, said God, with hutches and hives and room for your wife and your sons and their wives. The ark Noah built was really quite big, a wheel for each hamster, a stay for each pig, a perch for each parrot, a nest for each mouse, a kennel, a coop, and an elephant house. His neighbours looked over and grinned when they heard that Noah expected each beast and each bird. <gasps> Did someone say bird? I could hear a bird. Hello, Florence. Anyway. They laughed at God's plan, which was not very kind. Have a nice cruise. I think we'll stay behind. So Noah banged in the last of the nails and stood back and looked down to see two tiny snails. One, two. They were crawling up onto the big open doors while way in the distance came two mighty roars from these guys. Lions and zebras arrived by the pair. Think of an animal, yep, it was there. Noah and family looked at the crowd. It was awfully smelly and really quite loud. I bet it was smelly. There's a lot of chicken poo in our lives at the moment. Hippos park here, insects come next. Giraffes, feet on the ground, necks at the top deck. From monkeys to donkey, to skylark to shark, they all have a space in my car park ark. That's a bit of a tongue twister for me. His sons like the kennel, his wife loved the hutch. But space for the rest, there didn't seem much. Oh, spaces, said Noah, I've certainly got them. They start at the top and they fill to the bottom. Wow. <coughs> Penguin, a little mouse. I can see a chick. I can see a chick mm. in there. The animals parked up as if they were cars. Two beetles, two mustangs, two jaguars. Last up, the snails finished climbing the ramp. With shells they'd not noticed, now were rather damp. Quick, shouted Noah. Give the door a good pull. And... He put up a sign, car park arc now full. The animals jiggled within Noah's ark. It rained and it rained and it rained a bit more. But could it get worse? Yes, it started to pour. 40 days later, blue sky up above. Noah thought, hmm, I'll send out a 
Dove. Mrs. Noah, why let the dove fly? Ah, replied Noah, to spy land from the sky. So the dove flew away, and when it came back, it carried a leaf from a tree as a snack. The ark found that tree too. It crashed and it clattered. The mighty doors opened and the animals scattered. And up in the sky, a rainbow appeared their arc time was over. The animals cheered. Yay! And God made a promise to save our creation. So when we see animals, birds, vegetation, love and respect all, that mooing and barking, and love this fine space that God's let us park in. The end. Well, I hope you enjoyed Noah's car park art. That's a really cool story, isn't it? I imagine it would have been really smelly, but a lot of fun on that boat. And I'm sure there would have been room for Florence as well. Well, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of the week and really, really look forward to seeing you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.